Well, I think a free press is an essential part of a properly functioning democracy. And it is a matter of great concern that we've seen newspapers going out of business and fewer reporters uh, telling the public about what is going on. The United Kingdom has a reputation around the world for our support for individual freedom and civil liberty. This is the country that 800 years ago uh, drew up Magna Carta. Uh, and therefore people do look at this country uh, and follow our lead on issues around individual li liberty, including that of press freedom. Everybody in public life will sometimes not like what is written in the press. Uh, and obviously we have defences both in terms of defamation laws and the uh, press regulatory body. But I would far have a free press and sometimes dislike what I read than not have a free press which is prevented from writing about injustice, about uh, corruption, about maladministration, because it is the duty of the press to sometimes cause uh, unhappiness to those in power. It's certainly not always the case that the public interest and what interests the public coincide, uh, but that ultimately has been adjudicated by the courts. And generally, you know, if it is a story uh, which involves public figures, whether there is some suggestion of malpractice, then that is clearly in the public interest. The UK has a great reputation for press freedom. Uh, we uphold the freedom of the media here, but that is not to say there aren't challenges. Uh, and the Society of Editors does a great job uh, in raising awareness of concerns where press freedom may be under threat uh, and campaigning against them.